Hi, I'm Gabby from Pebble Go, and today I'm really excited to share with you how easy it is for you to add students to your classes in Pebble Go Create. So let's get started. If you want to add students to your class manually, there's a couple of different ways that you can do so. So of course, you're going to select your class and then click on the Add Student button. Now you have a couple different options to choose from. So of course, if you have already created student accounts, you don't need to recreate them every time you make a new class. You can just choose to add from student list. But if you have new students, you have a couple ways you can add them. You can import from a CSV file if you have that. You can drag and drop it in and you can download a sample to make sure that it's set up the way that it needs to be set up. And that's really easy, maybe if you have that info sitting around already. And the other way is to just go ahead and add it in manually yourself right here. The only information you need is a first name, a last name, a unique username, and a six character password. So when you're setting it up, um, you can use one password if you want to for your whole class. Uh, and you also uh, do have the option of adding picture password. We'll take a look at that later. But uh, you do need, oh, again, a first name, a last name, and a unique username. So I'll go ahead and just add in an example here. And for the username, it could be a minimum of three characters. So it could be the student's initials or, or the first three letters of their student ID, just as an example. And then you can go ahead and choose a password. You can do one password and then you only have to type it in once when you're setting up your whole class. So let's do create as an example. So now that I have all of that info, I can click the plus sign and that student is ready to be added. Now because we use the one password, uh, that password is already populated here. So all we have to do for the rest of our students is first name, last name, and unique username. So once you do all of that, you can go ahead and put that in. And when you're ready, you can go ahead and click on the save button. And that will save all of your students information. You can download it for your use uh, now or later. Um, it's totally up to you and your student has been added to the class. Now, if you need to edit any of this information, just click on edit and you can edit anything you need to here. You'll notice that you can also enable simple login. Simple login or picture password is a great option for students who might struggle with typing in a long password. So you can pick two stickers from this selection and click save. When our student logs into Pebble Go Create, they can enter in their unique username and then they'll see those selection of images again and they'll remember that they are Flamingo Deer. They will click on those images and they will be logged into their account. Click save when you're done making any changes and you're all set and ready to go and your students now have actually an easier way to log in with their picture password. And it's as simple as that. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.